What's good people here, it's boy Junji K back with another reaction video. Today we got Print and the Revolution, When Does Cry. Uh, I believe this was James Crane. Thank you very much, James Crane, for that. Um, yeah, never watched the official music video. I have heard the song, uh, but I haven't actually seen the music video, so expect a great reaction from me. Before we start this video, just I just want to clarify um, something. Um, for those of you that are new to the channel, you may watch one of my videos and think, oh, he's, why is Jordan limiting himself? Why is he doing this? Now, I would say if you're subscribing to this channel, what go through all the videos that I've reacted to, and you're going to find that I ex will explain in detail what this channel is going to be about, what I'm doing, what the whole purpose is as to why I'm doing eight videos, 10 videos, um, between each artist. Now I'm doing that to get across a scale of artists in a short amount of time because I want to go through the 80s, 90s, 2000s. Now I could sit here and do hundreds and upon hundreds of videos of Queen. I could sit here and do hundreds upon hundreds of videos of Michael Jackson, uh, you know, so, and so on. But uh, like I said, this is a new channel. I haven't even reached 100 videos yet, number one. Um, and I, I have never said to you guys that I would never come back to these previous artists that I've reacted to already, like Michael, like Queen, like Jimmy. Never said that I'm going to stop doing reactions to them, guys. Um, all I'm saying is um, I'm doing eight to ten videos. Sometimes it could be less because remember, guys, you got you got to remember some videos uh, YouTube actually hold against me. So if you go on my channel now and you look at the Jimi Hendrix videos, it may seem like I've reacted to less videos, but I've actually reacted to three more videos that YouTube are holding against me because when you have a reaction channel, there are going to be big companies that hold those videos against you and they may not, YouTube, sometimes they don't release the videos. Like the other day, Purple Rain, I recorded Purple Rain and it was blocked on YouTube. They wouldn't release it. Um, so... I almost I was about to record another video just to try and explain to you guys that YouTube does hold my content sometimes because of the music in the video right but luckily their Warner Brothers they released the claim they checked my video they saw that I was a reaction channel and they released it and then now it's you know public for you guys to see so some of the video even Queen I reacted to a couple of Queen videos and, and they still haven't released those videos but people are saying oh you've reacted to less video so you've got to understand sometimes there are some artists or some songs I might not be able to react to because of copyright claim and because of YouTube sometimes YouTube just doesn't allow you the you know they just don't release the songs and it's down to YouTube it's not down to me if it was down to me I'd love to react to every single song out there but sometimes it's just not that's just not realistic um, so that's why sometimes you may see less because I can't react to every single song because of YouTube. Um, and the other thing is, I, you know, I'm always going to be coming back to these artists. Do not worry, guys. This is a reaction channel. It's not a reaction channel based on one person. It's a reaction channel, you know, reacting across all different music genres. And in future, we're going to be doing some new stuff. So if you're here for the long journey, you want to be a part of the Jordan GK Reacts crew. Hey. I know, you, I know you're here for the long one, all right? I know you're here for the long one to stay. Um, and I'm going to be reacting to different artists, guys. I'm not just going to be reacting to one genre of music. In future, there's going to be different genres of music. Don't worry. So, you know, I'm not one of these guys that only only going to react to old school music. Nah. No, man. I'm going to be fair. I'm going to listen to new types of music. And I'm, you know, going to give my feedback on it. And that's, that's what this reaction channel is made for, man. Anyway, guys, you know the score. Without further ado... Let's get straight into the video. Okay. Oh. 
I'm on, he's wearing high heels. He's wearing high heels, man. Hey, nothing against that. I, I guess that was the trend back in the eighties. Like, I, you know, I've done, I've been doing a lot of my research on the eighties era, man. Like, and this was their, this is their trend, man. This was their style. It was very, the men kind of dressed like women because it would be more sexier. Um, obviously nowadays it's completely different like you wouldn't see a guy wearing i mean you might see some some of those artists wearing high heel boots and stuff like that um but not you know that was the trend back then you know you go through different trends right but i just love his style man it's definitely something probably i would wear in the 80s i don't know if i could pull it off but you know i'd probably wear something similar to that if i was in that era man but yeah let's continue with you <laughs> Oh. I'm guessing that these scenes are from the movie. Um, I'm just guessing. I have no idea. But uh, I think it's just the way this kind of music video is presented. It looks like it. Because someone mentioned that um, there was a movie, a Purple Rain movie. So I'm guessing. Because my, I know that When Does Cry was in that album, I think. Um, but I'm guessing these are different scenes from the movie. Just guessing. But very cool, man. Very cool. Oi! He looks exactly like Jimi Hendrix, man. Like Jimi Hendrix with that musketeer blouse. I don't think I could dig that suit, though, man. I don't think I could dig that suit nowadays, man. That's definitely an 80s style kind of suit. But I've noticed, man. They're kind of. I don't, I don't know if that was everyone's style back in the 80s, but I know, I know in the 80s they wore suits to parties. That you wear like a full on suit to a club, and you don't really do that nowadays, but. Which is a shame. I think I think dressing smart is a good thing, right? When you go out. But um, yeah, man, they look really cool, man. Awesome. They got their own kind of unique style. Um, I think Prince is one of those guys that can just fit into anything and look good. But yeah, man, let's go. Let's continue. Wow, okay. It's like that, yeah? Okay. Thank you again, James Crane, man. Really do appreciate it. Um, I do believe... Let me say... Yeah, I will shout you out in the next video also. Again, for this. Um, yeah. My reaction to it... Sorry, guys, man. I was lost in my thoughts there. My reaction to it... Um, 
very very good don't worry about the backing music there man the backing sound if you can hear it it's awful um yeah my reaction to it guys very good song man like i think the scenery was awesome like when he was on the motorbike the purple motorbike i think that's on the, the i think it's on the purple rain cover that motorbike man very iconic bike um i like the contrast between the different when he's with the girl and then he's talking about you know he he's not sure who he is if he if he's more like his dad or his mom like it was all very like emotional very deep um and yeah man very good song overall you know for me at the moment like prince is definitely climbing up that ladder as being one of the greatest um it's between him and michael at the moment man i'm not too sure i'm not sure who who i can throw in here man we still got loads of other artists to come come towards we still got you know other really good bands to react to but hey we're gonna we're gonna find out who's gonna be that king at the end of it man i'm definitely gonna announce a king at the end of it i'm not i'm done with people saying oh you know i'm not sure who was better i'm gonna choose for you if you can't choose i end up choosing man um we'll see in the next video man we still got more prints so hey i've I'm, you know i've still got more more to come with prince man there's gonna be some songs that might shock me that might make me feel that he's the king i have no idea yet but until then it's between michael and uh prince for me at the moment anyway guys that is the end of the video make sure you like and subscribe to the channel remember to hit that notification bell so you're up to date with the latest videos guys you hear your boy john gk and i will see you in the next video